All right, welcome back to another video, guys. Today we have something called the Blue Ghost Tunnel for you. This was an, you can hear the coyotes barking in the background there. So this was an old railway tunnel. Pretty cool place. Inside we're gonna find some giant ice sculptures and stuff like that, so looking forward to seeing that again. And yeah, let's get into it. All right, guys, let's go into the tunnel. Got a creaky gate. Better close that so the coyotes can't get in. All right, so I looked up a bit of history on this place. Um, so it's called, so it's known as the Meriton Tunnel, Blue Ghost Tunnel, and the Grand Trunk Railway Tunnel. So it's an abandoned railway tunnel, and uh, the reason they built it was to have a more durable and less interrupted way to cross the new canal situated directly above it via vehicles. So it was built in 1875, and it opened in 1887. So we've got some uh, drain water here, guys. Um, it's frozen on top, but, oh yeah, you can see the ice is moving where it meets the brick wall there. So this is definitely not frozen solid, but you can see there's all sorts of uh, garbage and stuff in here. It looks like a spring down there, all rusted. And we've got a, got a chair, I think that is. Well, you can put some weight on it, but uh, yeah, I wouldn't want to walk on this entirely, but it's, it's solid. So you can see we've got some uh, water that's been dripping down here and uh, creating these ice mounds. Stalactites, stalagmites, can't remember which is which. But yeah, this is the first signs of the ice forming. And here you can see all the, uh, the railway ties as well. So it looks like they're, they're pretty, they're eroded really badly actually. This is nowhere near flat anymore. And um, yeah, so it's, uh, you gotta watch your step when walking through here, for sure. But as you can see, lots of kids have been in here, uh, spray painting the place, just generally tagging it. Nothing very interesting at all or um, even creative, it's just, just swear words and uh, kids being stupid as usual, right? But um, so here you can see uh, the cross braces that they've put up to try and uh, help save the tunnel. Keep it from collapsing. So these are uh, throughout this whole section of the tunnel here. And they're, uh, yeah, they're right around six feet off the ground because I can just barely fit underneath them without hitting my head.
But I mean, they seem to be doing their job because the tunnel hasn't collapsed yet. Oh boy, someone was having a party down here. Not sure what they were doing with this thing, but it's got a rope tied around its neck and uh, so it looks like it was probably hanging from one of these, uh, these joists at one point. So hopefully it was just for some sort of decoration and not for uh, <laughs> its in intended purpose. All right guys, we've made it to the, the ice castle, let's call it that. This is gonna be slippery, holy crap. Just look at this, this wall of ice here. And you can hear the water just seeping in and dripping. So it's considerably warmer in here than it is outside. Um, so yeah, I guess it has to be really cold for, uh, for this to happen. But isn't that incredible? Absolutely amazing. See my breath, guys. It's pretty cold in here. So this whole floor is ice, guys. It's like being on a skating rink without skates, except that it's not flat. So it makes it even worse. But it seems that this is the, uh, the area with the heaviest amount of ice. As you can see, it's just, uh, just incredible. So I was here when when this tunnel was iced up before, and there's actually more ice than this, and there were some areas that I couldn't actually get through, through the ice. Um, so yeah, this is actually kind of ideal because there's lots of ice to make, make it look interesting, but not so much that you can't pass by. But I mean, like, this is just incredible. Like here's, here's my, oh shit. Uh, <laughs> so here's my leg for scale. Oh fuck. 
Sorry guys, I keep slipping. <laughs> Here's my leg for scale, so that's about as tall as my knee. And uh, it's another big ice blob. And uh, here's where the, uh, the railway ties end. And it becomes a bit of a lake. So you can't go much further than this. Um, yeah, I guess in theory it's frozen, but I really don't want to go for a swim today, so I'm not going to go any further than this. So that was the Blue Ghost Tunnel, Meriton Tunnel. So a lot of people actually say this tunnel's haunted. So I guess if uh, you believe in that sort of thing, then yeah, maybe it is haunted. Um, I don't know, I guess it just all depends on what you believe in, but I've been here a number of times and nothing's ever happened that I can't explain, so. Um, yeah. Oh. Alright guys. You can see I had some trouble uh, navigating the ice there. I fell. Almost on them right under my butt. Really hope you enjoyed this video. I know I really like coming here in the winter because it's just such a unique experience. So surreal, um, just like another world, right? So yeah, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Yeah, you know, share it as well. So yeah, thanks a lot for watching and until next time. Okay.